Elderly persons aged 65 and above are expected to more than double from 14 to 30 percent of the population in 30 years. With an ageing population, expenditure on social welfare and health services, which accounts for some 30 to 40 percent of the government's recurrent expenditure, would unavoidably increase. Attending to the welfare of the elderly and health of the community is the shared responsibility of the government and the community. The unit costs of providing nursing home places, old age living allowance and health care services etc. are substantial. These costs would rise further if service qualities are to be enhanced. The elderly population will more than double in 30 years. Even with no service enhancement and disregarding inflation, expenditure on elderly services is expected to double or even triple in 30 years. The demand for healthcare services, in terms of hospitalisation rate and average length of hospital stay, is much higher for elderly persons than other age groups. Government's recurrent funding for hospitals and healthcare services is expected to double in 30 years. The government must earmark additional funding to cope with the additional demand for elderly welfare and services in the coming 20 to 30 years. Even without service enhancement, the projected growth in social welfare and health expenditure would exceed that of the economy government revenue and total government expenditure. Given the immense challenges posed by an ageing population, the sustainability of our fiscal health is a real issue that calls for proper attention.